the young and the restless spoilers. In the opulent boardroom of Newman Enterprises, the air was thick with tension. Cole Howard and Victoria Newman, two formidable figures in Genoa City's corporate and social landscape, had convened a small, private meeting to discuss a matter close to their hearts, the future of Claire Howard. Look, Victoria, Cole began, his voice steady yet edged with concern, we need to talk about Claire. Her involvement with Kyle has only complicated her life, especially given Kyle's tumultuous past and the tangled relationships he's still entangled in. Victoria nodded, her expression serious. I agree, Cole. Kyle Abbott has always been a source of drama and instability. As much as we want to protect Claire, she needs to understand the gravity of the situation. Kyle Abbott, for his part, found himself caught in a web he had never intended to weave. His past with Claire was marked by moments of intense passion and equally intense conflict. Now, the present was no less complicated, with old flames and new entanglements creating a volatile mix. Despite his best intentions, Kyle couldn't seem to extricate himself from the mess, nor could he shield Claire from its repercussions. If Kyle had any real fortitude, he'd protect Claire no matter what, Cole continued, frustration seeping into his voice. But right now, he's not capable of that. Claire deserves stability, a chance at a peaceful, happy life. Claire Howard, caught in the crossfire of her parents' protective instincts and her own desires, felt a deep sense of longing. She yearned for a happy family, a peaceful life free from the incessant drama that seemed to follow her and Kyle. Yet, achieving that dream seemed increasingly difficult. Cole, Victoria said softly, we need to make Claire see reason. She should let go of Kyle, return to a simpler, quieter life, and maybe even consider meeting someone new. Their resolve to separate Kyle and Claire was clear, but neither Cole nor Victoria fully grasped the depth of Claire's determination. Headstrong and independent, Claire had never been one to bend easily to the will of others, even her own parents. No, Claire had declared when her parents first broached the subject. I won't let anyone dictate my life. I love Kyle, and I will decide what's best for me. The small meeting erupted into a heated argument. Cole, usually composed, found himself raising his voice, trying to get through to his daughter. Claire, you don't understand. We're trying to protect you. Kyle is not the man you need. Victoria, equally impassioned, added, we only want what's best for you. Think about your future, about the kind of life you want to lead. But Claire, resolute and fiery, stood her ground. I want to make my own choices, even if they're mistakes. I need to live my life on my own terms. You both need to respect that. As the argument reached its peak, Victoria, known for her own fierce independence, began to see a reflection of herself in her daughter. Claire's spirit was unyielding, her desire for autonomy undeniable. The room fell silent as Victoria realized the futility of their efforts to control Claire's decisions. Sighing, Victoria looked at Cole, then back at Claire. I see there's no change in your mind. Just promise me you'll be careful. Claire softened slightly, recognizing the concern behind her mother's words. I will, mom. But please, trust me to handle my own life. Cole, still unconvinced but resigned, nodded slowly. All right, Claire. But remember, we're always here for you. As the meeting concluded, Claire felt a mix of relief and determination. She knew the path ahead with Kyle would be fraught with challenges, but she was ready to face them head on. Her parents' opposition had only strengthened her resolve to forge her own destiny. Meanwhile, Kyle, unaware of the storm brewing behind closed doors, grappled with his own dilemmas. He wanted to be the man Claire needed, to provide her with the stability and happiness she deserved. But his past and present were like chains, holding him back. Yet, knowing Claire's steadfastness, he felt a glimmer of hope. Perhaps, together, they could navigate the turbulent waters and find the peace they both longed for. As Genoa City continued its ceaseless dance of ambition, power, and passion, Claire and Kyle's story was far from over. With love as their compass, they prepared to face whatever challenges lay ahead, determined to carve out a future together, despite the odds.